What's up guys, it's Dunno Rage Master for another video for you. Well this one's gonna be about The Walking Dead predictions who will kill the governor. Well if you watch my Welcome to the Tombs on review, I did drag on a bit who will kill it, but then I decided to make a whole new video about just who will kill the governor because it's quite a big topic and that's not the biggest. There's a lot of stuff to talk about, but we might as well start here. It's as important as any. So Basically, I think my options who's going to kill the governor, Michonne, she's on my list because in the comics, she's the one who tortured the governor, but she didn't kill the governor, she tortured the governor. So that's basically, oh yeah, also, because the governor hates her so much in the TV series, he, he wants her to like torture her in this, it's like the other way around, isn't it, that it's just... Yeah, so that's why Michonne's on the list because the governor hates her so much, and she at the beginning of the series she's like, "I got to finish this." Andrea was on the list, but then she died, so goodbye, Andrea. And then Mo was also on the list. I really thought he was gonna kill him at the end of the series in three, but he didn't. He's dead as well, so he's on list as well. And then who else was in it? Rick is not on my list. The reason why it's not is just it's too obvious that Rick would kill the governor, and it's just you can't have the main character killing the other. Dude, it's just too common, so he's not on my list, and it doesn't seem they. I know they don't like each other, but it's not like they don't have anything personal. It's literally just like the the two sides. Like Michonne had something personal, but then Therese. The reason why I think Therese is when the comics he kills the governor chops Therese's head off, and it'd be funny if it was the other way around in the TV series. Yeah, and. Well, cha I don't quite know. It would be quite cool if Charis killed the governor, and but he does go on about I don't kill other humans and stuff. But I think he will kill the governor because he did kill a lot of his friends. I think he was friends with those guys at Woodbury, and he would kill the governor if he had the chance. I think he would, yeah. And it would just be funny if it was the other way around in the TV series. He killed the governor. Or if the governor actually does chop his head off, I'll be quite sad because he's my like my third favorite character in season three, and I'm already quite sad that Mel died. He was my fifth. Make sure you watch my video with my five favorite characters. So Tyrese is on the list, and then who else is on my list? Was that was that a really obvious one? What was it? Oh, Karen, Karen. It doesn't seem quite obvious. Karen, if you guys don't know who Karen is, she's not like a main part. She is that girl who survived the massacre when the governor killed his men. She's that one person who survived. That is one of the reasons why I think Karen is going to kill the governor because she did survive that and she saw lots of her friends and fam probably not family, but maybe got killed. And it's like quite really personal, like not just Michonne personal, like really personal on this one. And then, yeah, and in the comics, I think that was her who, I gotta check it up in my comic series, what was actually right behind me, that I think it was her that shot her because there's this girl with black hair who looks just like her, and why would they put her in such a big character in season, why would they put her in such a big character in the TV series if she's not gonna do something big? Like, yeah, I know she survived that, they have to tell someone to survive that. But she has black hair and she looks like the girl in the comics and I think the girl in the comics is called Karen as well. And she, she actually shoots the governor as soon as they take over the prison. And yeah, she shoots the governor as soon as they take over the prison. And it's like they were carrying a baby and they're good people. I don't know how she knew they were good people. Could be an evil baby. And she just shot him randomly like, take that. So yeah, they're my three really people who I think might kill the governor. I think number one is Karen. Number two, Daryl, some people are like, come on Daryl, you kill the governor, but I'm just like, no, because Mo was the brother who would kill the governor. Daryl doesn't have nothing personal with the governor, he's just fine for Rick. He just wants his people to be, uh, like, you know, help. It's like, those three have really, like, met the governor properly. I know Rick has in that arrow on the doorpost, but yeah, and Milton, he was the other one who died, who was on my list. But he died, so I got two people who died on my list. Um, Merle, Milton, and Andrea. 
they were the three who died who uh, who I thought would kill the governor, but they were all off. So my number one who I think would kill out of those three, Karen, because in the comics, I think they're gonna throw the comics on this one. Number two, I think Michonne. And then number three, Therese. Be cool if Therese would kill him because I like Therese and he's one of my fit I like Michonne more, he's my she's my second favourite character of season three. But I just think it'd be cool if Tyrese kills him. Like smacks him in the back of the head with his hammer. So this has been the Anno Rage Master. Make sure to subscribe for more Walking Dead vids, gaming vids, anything you want me to do. Oh yeah, and comment below guys, I'm trying to get this like thing started up. That like this thing like a Twitter thing, like a conversation going about this video in the comments below so make sure to subscribe and of course get that comments going share like and sub see you guys next time